Hello everybody and welcome back to another episode of XCOM HQ and everything is exactly as we left off no random missions have happened whilst we've been gone so I'm gonna skip over a few days hopefully we can get three days in the bank without any incidents because we've got the thin man autopsy and the council report happening in three days and then we get some extra money from the council report. That would be lovely jubbly. Okay, so we got to the Thin Man Autopsy. Let's do some more research. There's the information if you wish to read it. Pause it right now because I'm going to skip over. There we go. Right. Now, a priority is to do the shard. But... I really want to get my guys some nice new armor so I'm going to research some armor instead I've always thought of science as a way to improve our everyday lives to answer the long-standing questions of scientific history the aliens though it's obvious now that they consider science simply a means to an end using and discarding life as needed to reach their goal Whatever that may be. Okay. And with that, let's try and get to the council report. If we can. No, no. Is this a council report? Is this. Excellent work, yes. Commander. This council is pleased to see our continued support of this project has been worthwhile. Yes. We hope that your current successes. Nope only mark the beginning of an enduring effort to eliminate the extraterrestrial threat. Okay, everyone's talking a lot today. So, we got a UFO shut down, terror mission stopped one, abduction stopped two, satellites launched one, research object projects completed seven, UFOs raided one, and UFOs escaped one. Which is our only minus, as far as I can see. The panic levels aren't so great in some of the countries, but we've got a grade B overall, so I am not going to complain too much. We got our 525 Remember, credits, will be watching. and yeah, I think we are doing just fine right now. Let's skip ahead a little bit. Our satellite is prepped and standing by for launch. We are ready to deploy it on okay. orders. And is there anything else we can actually build? I would quite like to get another scope in since we've got so many uh, so many snipers. Uh, a nanofiber vest, that might be a good idea. A laser pistol would also be a very good idea. I'm gonna get, say, three of them. We'll get three of them. Because we want them for the snipers. A med kit, maybe? 346 credits we're left with. Hmm. Nano fiber vest. Should we get two of them? Submit that order. Now it should do for now, I think. Should we maybe get some of these? Yes, yes, I think we should. I think we should. Okay, these are all that you pretty much waste them straight away and they cost the bomb. Oh, I use one dodge and one aim. Okay, that, that doesn't cost so much. I'll get two of them. Okay, that's fine. Just leave it there. <laughs> right, let's go to the barracks officer training school. And let's increase the squad size. That will be amazing help for us. That will be great. So let's increase the squad size. And I think for now we can just skip over a few days. We're only left with 193 credits. Oh, good lord. Wait, if we've made. If we've made a satellite, we should probably launch it. <laughs> that, would, that would be a good idea. Okay, where are we gonna launch our next satellite? Uh, come. Oh, rid. 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 Launch satellite. There we go. This might like it. Where should we put this one? Should we put one in Canada? 
Mexico, maybe? They are the biggest panicking areas at the moment. What do we get from each? We get a bonus to airspace from Canada. We get an engineer per month. And pretty much the same from Mexico. Uh, At least we've got some vets on our side. Yeah. It takes a serious pair to go face to face with one of those things. With one of what things? <laughs> right, so it is that. Yeah, there's a big difference in money. We get more money from Canada, so I'm going to send them to Canada. Let's launch that satellite. Right. So if we want any more satellites, which I do think we've got... Uh, oh, have I made both of them? Right, so in order to launch the next one, we do need some more uh, uplinks. Which will be a pain in the backside, because that's going to be more money, and then I'm not going to be able to buy my armor. I appreciate no. your efforts to no. support the research team, Commander. I'm gonna. I've already put the new sh recruits to work. Shush, shush. I'm just going to skip over a few days. I want that armor. No, you can't have laser pistols. Go away. Okay. And yes, okay. So we've got the armor now. This one I want for the snipers. This will be lovely jubbly. This one. At least if it's the one I'm thinking of. Right, okay. Experimental warfare. Precision lasers. So, this is lasers for our snipers. Uh, I would quite like that. Is it skeleton suit I've been thinking about? Yeah, a couple of suits. Can I... Oh yeah, that's the one I want for the snipers. Okay. So, we need to get that one researched ASAP. Basically, now I'm in a rush because I've been concentrating on money so far. And if you don't concentrate on armor and weapons, the game will not wait for you. The game is brutal like this. It will quickly, quickly become terrifying. There we go. So Canada should be a bit happier. Okay, abduction sites. Abductions in progress are marked on the hollow globe. Okay, so that's India. It's got a difficult one. You get four scientists for it. Uh, over here we have a new recruit assault lieutenant. It's a difficult one in Brazil. And Germany. All of them have fairly low panic ratings, except uh, Brazil is up two instead of just up one. I don't know. A assault, another assault would not be such a bad thing. Maybe we should go for Brazil. Okay, I'm thinking yeah. I'm thinking yeah. <laughs> yeah. Okay, well I want to go back right now because I want to go to engineering and maybe we should build some of that armor if we can. Oh no, we can't. We need 12 alloys. Oh god. Oh dear, this is not good. I've spent too much money on pistols. Right, okay. In that case, we're just gonna have to go with it. I don't, I don't, I don't mind, I don't, I don't mind. I don't, I don't mind. I don't, mind. I don't know what you're talking about. I'm not worrying about this. Okay. So who have we got? Right. We have Evans is back. Casino Evans, as he likes to be called. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to give him the uh, nanofiber vest. Make him a little bit stronger. I'm going to give Thompson a scope. That would be good. Uh, Gonzalez is our medic, so I'm gonna give... Oh no, I'm not. I'm gonna leave him with the med kits. <laughs> Set that right off. I'm not taking that out. <laughs> right? Okay. I will give Kazumi Mori her own laser pistol. That might be useful. 
and I will do the same for Thompson. He can have one as well. That is fine. And what now? Let's see, what have we got left? I think. What have we got? What have we got? You can have a grenade. Let's give him a grenade. He's a new guy. Nobody knows who he is yet. The arc thrower medkits go. go uh, actually, no. We're going to give him an arc thrower if we've got any left. Have we got any left? No. Who's got the other arc thrower? Hmm. I don't know. But I think this might be okay overall. <clears throat> Let me think. We could do with another arc thrower, really. I can't remember who on he <laughs> who the hell has the other arc thrower. I've got that many troops. I don't fancy going through them all to check. So I'm just gonna buy another one. Let's just buy another one. Much easier. Here you go, Brazil again. Yeah, yeah. Okay, I'm sorry about the back and forth on this. We really need to just sort that out. Okay. Now, James Smith's joining us, Casino Evans. Yeah. Okay, I'm comfortable with that. Three red coats, three fully fledged troops. I'm happy with that. Uh, should we see if there's any better armor for our good friend? Oh no, not the tint, the deco. No, we don't want that one. That one just looks weird. Yeah, so we'll leave him with that. That's fine. Um, can we give you a hat? Oh, wait, wait, I want the hat. What hats have we got? <laughs> yeah, it, that suits a heavy. But the, I don't think it suits the white. Hmm, <laughs> sunglasses for super cool awesomeness. Or a microphone so he actually looks like he's useful. <laughs> Let's leave him like that. <laughs> he does look like a bit of a mess. I, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Evans, but you do. <laughs> okay, I think I'm ready to go. And with this, guys, I'm going to shoot over onto the mission. I will see you there.